what's happening everybody all right today we're doing a little quick thing on predator dreads okay I figured out a new way to do these um, I was trying it I was trying it with the foam insulation here and everything and I cut it and I just didn't like the way it was working uh, got the latex mold builder here um, and I just didn't like the way this worked so I figured okay let me try something different so what I did is I took and I made a mold I made one out of clay I made a dread out of clay and then I made a mold and I poured the mold and then what I've been doing is I've been using this flex foam it's like a urethane two-part foam mix from smooth on and I took that and I poured that into the mold I colored it with black paint and this is what I get I mean it's like flexible it's pretty tough too um, it just like I mean I didn't pour enough in it so this one didn't go all the way but I'm gonna redo it and this is great now what I'm gonna do is probably color my latex mold builder with black and put over the top of it but you can see it's like you know it's pretty cool now I did it a couple different ways this one here I just used urethane on and this one here I did a little weird I actually lined the inside of it with horse hair so this one actually has hair on it and this one when you bend it it kind of stays bent now this one's a little bit heavier and everything this one's a little different and then I covered the outside of it with aluminum powder because it didn't cure all the way but this one's weird because it feels it moves it feels like it's got stuff you can feel the hair moving in it and everything and it's a little different I don't know this one's a little weird but I don't know I might try it but it, it feels like it's alive it's kind of different but anyway so this is the way this is that one's a little bit heavier and my cats love it obviously so this one's a little bit lighter so I'm gonna go ahead and try this and paint it with the liquid latex and see what kind of strength I got on it and we'll go from there so there you go there's a quick little thing on making your own dreads all right have a good one